this is Chow on tour episode and today we are going to visit a specialty coffee shop called The Alchemy in Dubai, United Arab Emirates. Come and join me. The weather is really very hot. It's about 40 degrees centigrade here and um, I am sure that everybody here would love iced coffee. Welcome to the Alchemy in Dubai and this shop has got very few items on their menu. They have espresso, macchiato, Gibraltar, long black, piccolo, flat white and latte. Everything that coffee lovers would have, nothing more. That's all you really need. And then they have many different types of brewing methods here. They have the Kalita Way, Aeropress, V60, Chemex, cold brew and cold drip. Danny, the senior barista here at Alchemy. Thank you for giving us an opportunity. You're welcome. So, what are you going to make me? So, uh, I'll be making for you a nice V60, okay. which happens to be one of our best sellers, okay. because everyone is under the weather. Tell us about your coffee beans before we start. Uh, so, uh, today uh, I'm using coffee beans from Ethiopia. Okay. Uh, they are natural processed coffee. And they have some really, really, really amazing uh, notes. Mm -hmm. uh, Tell me about the notes. So the that notes. I know uh, what to expect. Uh, yes. So, uh, so this Ethiopia, it's really sweet. It has some uh, floral flavors, and also uh, you can get to experience uh, uh, like orange-like uh, acidity, apple-like acidity as well. And uh, also, it has some really nice fruity uh, nuts. Okay. Yeah. I mean, there's so many flavor notes to it that I can't, you know, describe it all. But I can just give a couple of few of them. Okay. So uh, in this Ice V60, we uh, you will get to 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 experience some really nice mango, pineapple, and mango some pineapple. Uh, yeah. And also, it has a very nice uh, acidity which is more like to apple-like and that brings the sweetness to it yes. i'm so excited to try it let's do it yes let's okay, go let's do it <laughs> so you put the ice there yeah so i put uh, uh 200 grams of ice okay. and uh i'll be adding 150 ml of water okay yeah so basically the ice will melt and add up the rest of the ratio so I use uh, 17 grams of coffee beans. I intend sometimes to use a finer grinds because I want to, to, to bring the body into this coffee. Like when you drink it, you feel the mouthfeel. It's really palatable and it's something really nice. I brew it for about uh, uh, two minutes. Two minutes? Yeah. Wow, that's really fast. Yes, I do it, usually I do it fast because I don't want to, to keep the, the, the contacts time of water and the coffee for so long like to over extract the coffee yeah, so it's bitter, right? I, yeah exactly so I look out for the optimum really good time so mm -hmm. I can unlock the, the, the potential flavors as I told you in the coffee we use coffee freshly roasted about between five days for filter coffees and onwards uh, we've been open for the last four years okay. So I want to ask you as well. Ooh, wow. I want to ask you a question. How did you find Alchemy? How did I find Alchemy? Well, it came recommended. Uh, so true. what I did was to search for the top ten cafes here in Dubai. Okay. And Alchemy came on top. I'll give you just before I serve you like how we normally serve. Okay. I'll give you this one just to try. How I want you to. Serve? Let, no. Let me try before. Yes. Before he shows me how they normally serve. <laughs> let me try that. Yes. And uh, this cup is really cold. There we go. Wow. Yes. So that on the, is amazing. Exactly. Yes. So on your first sip, usually it work with. The coffee will welcome you with a very nice, subtle, acidic. Yeah. 
more like an apple like, mm -hmm. and that really brings the sweetness to the coffee. And then, I would, I would say, yeah, it's yeah. actually, I mean, for a fine grind coffee, I would think that um, mm. this is amazing. Yeah. You know, there's absolutely no bitterness at all. Yes, you're, you're right about the acidity there, mm. the taste of fruity um, notes that I could, I could mm. taste there. Mm. And uh, it just leaves a very, very refreshing feel <laughs> and health feel. I absolutely love it. This is Thank amazing. you. Thank you. Show me how you serve it. Yes, I will for sure. Do you want me to bring it to your table? Yes, please. All right. Thank you. Mm. This is how we serve it. Okay. But again, I'll love to explain to you and or guide you on how you should best drink our coffee okay, please do yes yeah, so uh like i was telling you earlier on about the water so basically it's just to clean your palates right. as you take more sips okay. so the first step yes take some water and this is sparkling water that's sparkling water i'm following what it's telling me <laughs> so okay. then now I just clean. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then you take your first seat. Uh -huh, yes. Absolutely, there's nothing left over from earlier. And in mm. fact, this one, I think this one helps a lot. Exactly. Yeah. It, it helps because at first you had coffee. Yeah. And then you didn't get a chance to drink that water just to clean up the first test you were having. So usually what we do, you, we let you take the water first to clean up your mouth. Then you take the first sip. Come back to water, clean up your mouth, prepare for the second sip. Every time I drink, I must... Yeah. Yes, yes. Be but I can, I can finish that without... <laughs> either ways, either ways. If it's, it's okay with you, it, it's real good. But for a better experience, we always guide you to take this water. So we, we actually prepare you for the next step on how to test the coffee. We serve all our coffees with water and, and we make sure that we, if we normally, if we, t we, we notice you like it's your first time to try this kind of coffee, we, we, put, we endeavor to indulge you in a very beautiful experience so that we can always, you know, put a mark on your brains that, yeah, there's a w better way to drink coffee. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, alchemy. Yeah, alchemy. That's why we are alchemy. Yeah, beautiful. All right. um, well, there is just one thing I would request to mm. make me a bit white because I would like to taste your espresso. Mm. Would that be okay? Yes, yes, sure, sure. That would be very okay. Okay, so All right. let's go then. Okay, cool. Okay. <laughs> so let's do some flat white. Oh, sorry, sorry, I just sorry. I had their iced coffee, so now I'd like their hot coffee. What hot coffee. coffee, yes. So normally what we do, we have some amazing baristas every shift. And when these guys come in, everyone calibrates the coffee and then they test the coffee depending on how they think it's really good for everyone else. Uh, as for me, normally I'll, I'll follow what they have, uh, uh, the recipes they have created along the way. And if I find, the, if I find somehow, somewhere where I need to adjust, I'll do that. But for now, I think everything was okay. They did a great job in the morning, so yeah, we're still going with the flow. All right. So which beans are you giving me now? Uh, yes, that's a good question. So normally, still, we serve different beans. Today we have uh, uh, Winston from Colombia and we have Santa Barbara from Brazil. Okay. Uh, the Colombia is really fruity and uh, the fruitness brings, brings that acidity on coffee. Usually, I wouldn't really love to try a coffee that is way too acidic. So uh, we prefer serving it as an Americano and some other sweet drinks. Okay. Yeah. So in this case, uh, I would love to offer you our Brazil, okay. uh, which he, which has some uh, notes of uh, roasted almonds, chocolate. Uh, it also some. Uh, it has a very nice body with a caramel okay. uh, uh, flavors into it. 
caramel aftertaste actually. It's really good. About 18 to 20? Uh, it's about 20. 20. Yeah. All our coffees come with water. Okay. That's one thing we can't forget. Thank you very much. Wow. There you go. Please enjoy. Yeah. So it's the roast almond you're talking about? Yeah, roasted almonds. Yeah. And then uh, some chocolate nuts. Right. As, as the more you keep drinking, you will experience different flavors to it. So wow. the temperatures right now could be a bit high, but as they go down, still you will taste some different nuts. Wow. I, I love it. Thank I you. I think the taste of the coffee is quite strong, which I, I really like. Um, mm. I think it's perfect with the, the milk there and the, the way you texture the milk is just fabulous. Thank you. Thank you. The, the, the whole purpose of uh, coffee with milk still is to test coffee. So that's why we focus more. So we can add anything but usually our aim is for you to still have an opportunity to test coffee. Yeah, but I would say here is that this coffee is more like coffee with milk. Mm. Whereas the others um, are like milk with coffee. Exactly. <laughs> and that's why I love mm. it. I give it my biggest thumbs up. Next time you are in Dubai, make sure you visit the alchemy. Ask yes. for dining. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Really it was a pleasure to have you guys around. Thank you. Thank you so much. Good. This is Danny, the senior barista here at the Alchemy in Dubai. Any last words for our viewers? Uh, yes. Uh, hi, everyone there. So uh, next time when you happen to be in Dubai, please do come and visit us here in Alchemy. We have some amazing coffees. We have some good vibes. And yeah, please come look, and check us on. Look for Danny and I can guarantee that you would love the coffee here. I do. And um, I'll definitely be back. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. We'll That's be all good. we have for now. I'll see you again for more of these tour episodes. In the meantime, stay safe, stay tuned. Thank you for watching. Ciao for now. Ciao.